Hello, I am Kumar, medical student and a psychology graduate. I have been known to have cocaine every day. Oops. Coke every once in a while. But in general, I will try to avoid the destructive most popular psychoactive drugs. Today, many people are getting crazy. I mean really crazy that they are spending lots of money for this than this. I don't want to really talk about me a few years back when I was really a coffee addict. I will become so anxious. I will be eating myself and uh, that much anxious and sleepless night I was doing. But now I just stopped everything. This topic is becoming so personal I guess. We should go inside the topic. Anyway, caffeine itself is a very white uh, powdery alkaloid where world consumes around 300 million every year these include the two african plants which are erba mate and guarana which you have known because of this stimulating property but you my viewers who are active analytical and great mind you are wondering how does it work and how does it stimulate that's what we're gonna see in this today's video i'll be uploading videos daily i guarantee you that this video or futures video and this channel makes you to rethink everything that you do in your life with latest news and knowledge. Welcome to Ajumedic. Basically you feel tired but the caffeine tricks you feel you are not. As simple as that, do you know what is 137 trimethyl xanthine? That is nothing but caffeine, but something is rotating in your mind. I know, similar kind of molecular formula you came across which is adenosine. Some people take adenosine better than others. It can be very uncomfortable. The drug itself only lasts in the body about 15 seconds. But what it does is basically produces acetol flat line until the heart can reset itself as simple as that it makes you sleepy but the caffeine is the hero of our video so it blocks the adenosine before it reacts so it increases the blood pressure heart rate everything people who love that will feel it caffeine peak in your bloodstream after 30 minutes you take it till half the body in seven hours so after the effect is gone you will take the caffeine the whole day People who loves it that will feel it. Caffeine peak in your bloodstream after 30 minutes and it goes to off the body in around 7 hours. So after the effect is gone, you will take the caffeine the whole day to stay alert. This arises a big question. Does caffeine is addictive? Sort of it is, but technically, I meant technically isn't. You will feel irritated and annoying after taking caffeine but after some time you will be fine i promise doctor says average person drinks caffeine 300 mg a day is that bad thankfully no like red bull has 80 mg of caffeine in it so the end is don't panic regarding the caffeine intake in day to day life it's okay you can drink thank you for watching this video if you want a real evidence you can just go through the description if you scroll a little bit, you can find the big social industry like Facebook and Instagram. I didn't own it, but I have a little account over there. That is the account names and you can just follow it out. But if you're too lazy to do that too, you can just uh, see that red button over downside. That is subscribe button. You can just click that out and you can just say whatever you want in the comment section. I mean, whatever you want it means you can roast me too. So see you in the next video. Until that, bye from Ajumedic. Ta-ta!